Hi, welcome to episode four of I Draw Stuff and Talk. I'm Rob Stenzinger, and I do the webcomic Art Geek Zoo, which is at artgeekzoo.com, which you might be there already. Um, do, 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 do. If these look familiar, awesome. If they don't, welcome. When I initially start, I'll be doing this wash technique, which is sort of a, a blocking in of the characters and whatnot. That that helps me get a good good idea of the space. It's it's a fun and, and actually you can get get a good idea of the lighting and where it's coming out if you if you take that technique a lot farther, which I learned from this awesome magazine Imagine Effects, which they're not sponsoring Art Geek Zoo, but um, they're absolutely welcome to. It's a really cool magazine. It's it's from the UK. It's a little expensive if you're in the US, but reasonable if you subscribe to it. Okay, so here we go. We're going to be seeing uh, four panels come out of this episode, which is called Four Rooms. Um, we have actually it's one of those situations where we have uh, four scenes, four different locations, different characters in every location, and it's kind of fun. We actually get to meet the guy with two first names, Ray Ray. Here he is right now, getting his pen stage um, filled in. And of course we get to uh, reunite with Big Bad Stu and his guard, who's named Guard. It's, you know, there's no U in it, so it's G-A-R-D. Anyway, um, and of course we have the mild confrontation based on Taka's jealousy of Styx going on in Styx's dorm room, which is uh, heavily decorated with the band, the, fict the fictional band, uh, Foam, Foam's materials. Um, <clears throat> so here we are in the Soundhouse Saloon seeing Big Bad Stu get penned, and I keep, this was a funny episode, I actually rotated through a few different stages where I might get a certain panel drafted pretty far and then you know, experiment with a earlier drafting technique for the other panels. Um, there's only four panels, it's kind of a nice thing to do. Um, to uh, it, it made it easy to do a little experimentation. Um, so here I'm coloring in uh, Baron Von Wolfensteiner and Sharkface who are going through the wrestling match which this is a um, the round where Sharkface gets the advantage. And here we go, getting the rest of the flat color put in. And after that, I go through the the, the shades, which act, adds a little bit of depth to the to the um, background. But especially, I, mean, I like to make the characters look a little bit cooler uh, than their flat cell shaded versions. Um, and that's actually something else I learned from Imagine Effects. And ideally, um, I'm using Art Geek Zoo to slowly flesh out more of a um, more experience doing fantasy art. Um, so it's a little bit of a hybrid, heavily leaning toward comic and cell shaded, of course. But uh, but it's a lot of fun to have that, that goal in mind as I'm working through. And here I'm wrapping things up, getting the text bubbles finally moved around and, and uh, replaced, quickly bubbled, and I'll get them outlined, and the episode's done. So thanks a lot for watching this episode of I Draw Stuff and Talk. Stay tuned.